Pics on your iPhone and sharing them with the world only takes a few seconds. Take the plate and you fit it in like so. But friends Margaret Musa and Eileen Blom prefer a less traditional way of creating those lasting memories. When you look at a tintype, you can almost feel what the person is feeling. It's called tintype. It's a style of photography that was made popular during the 1800s, particularly during the Civil War era. It's kind of like an ancient Polaroid where it's pretty instant. You can walk away with your image. After reading an article about tintype, Musa and Blom decided to learn the craft. Neither had experience in photography, so they found a rare two-day seminar in Brooklyn, and the rest is history. And it goes where the film would normally go on a camera like this. You can see Today they own gun cotton tintype photography in Bayview, Sorry, where they create true. unique images with dangerous chemicals. Pour this liquid and then gently rock it evenly over the plate. So I wait until it sets just a little bit so it's not a liquid anymore. It only takes a couple seconds. And then I take this into our dark box and put it in a silver nitrate bath for three minutes. There are no negatives in this process. So each tintype is original and can't really be duplicated. From start to finish, the entire process takes about 15 minutes. But in the end, you're left with a rustic and timeless photograph that's sure to last. Mostly we find that people who come to us are so interested in having some an heirloom, a relic that they can pass on to their families that is just one of a kind, so special. In Bayview, Tim Elliott, WISN 12 News. Gun Cotton Tintype is in Bayview. If you want to learn more about it, you'll find a link on our website, WISN.com. Just click on the On TV section.